hey, hey, hey. Cooking with your girl, Judy. Listen, y'all, this afternoon, I am going to fry fish with grits with a bacon, shrimp, and spinach sauce. Man. I'm going to get right on it. Because I don't want this to be no real long video. Okay? Now, I'm going to add a cup of flour. Now, this is for my fish now. A cup of um, cornmeal. I'm going to whisk whisk it together adding cayenne pepper about a tablespoon look like I put a little bit more table than a tablespoon in it but a tablespoon okay the Creole sauce uh, seasoning about a tablespoon also Paprika. <coughs> oh, excuse. Oh, excuse me. Paprika. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Ah. I hate to shake this pepper, but this pepper really gonna make me sneeze. Okay, about a tablespoon of pepper. Oh. About a tablespoon of salt. I've already got my fish in here, and I'm having, <coughs> excuse me, I'm having flounder. You can use catfish, wahi, any kind of fish you want. <coughs> oh, them seasonings is a rough. Okay, and I'm going to use fish seasoning. Okay, let me mix it around in there real good. Get that fish seasoning mixed all really good on that flounder. I'm going to let this sit for a minute. And they're little thin pieces. Okay, now we're going to sit that to the side. And I'm going over here to the other side to make the sauce. Okay, come on with me. Now, what I have put in the water for the grits is, where is it? Okay, here it is. I have put one bouillon cube of this, and this the Cajun seasoning bouillon cube. I put it in the water. Now remember, this ain't your average grits you gonna use for like fixing breakfast. This is gonna be with fish, okay? And I put a half a cup, I mean a half of a uh, a half of, of what, well one tablespoon of butter. And, I, and one bouillon cube, I did mention that. Okay, that's what's in here. Butter and bouillon cube, okay? And I've got it going on. I've got it cooking, simmering. And I'm gonna put two, four cups of water, two cups of grease. I'm gonna stir them around in there real good. Now the water's brown, and we want them grits to come out with flavor. Okay? Yes, we want them grits to come out with flavor. 
the Cajun flavor. And they've been on a minute. I'm gonna put about a half a cup of water in. And I'm gonna turn them down a little bit. Yes, these are going to really be good. I'm going to add like another half a cup. Because the bouillon cube is really, really rich. Okay? Then I'm going to put the top on and let them simmer for about maybe... Five minutes. Okay, there we go. Now, I'm going to add a half a stick of butter. Okay. I'm quicken it up now. And about a half. Because I'm making a lot of sauce. Because what's going to happen is that my kids are going to watch this on YouTube. And they're going to be like, Mama, you got to do this for us. So I'm going to use like three tablespoons of flour. Yeah, they're gonna want some of this too. And all I'm gonna have to do is just like bring out a couple of more pieces of fish with them. Okay? Cause I'm gonna already have this sauce made. turn like a brown caramel color and then I will be right back. Okay, look at here guys. I've got that roux, a brown caramel color. Then I'm getting ready to add chicken broth. Yeah, chicken broth go in here. I'm gonna add about two, uh, about two cups. I'm gonna get it stirred up real good in here. And look. Them grits. I'm gonna have add about a half a cup. Uh oh, can you see it? About a half a cup of half and half. Okay. And they've been on about maybe about five minutes. Okay? Then I'm gonna add about two cups of cheese. And, am I, I, and I am adding the yellow cheese. Now you can add Parmesan cheese, or you can add um, mozzarella cheese. Oh, don't let me forget about my brew. Okay. Get that stirred up real good. I'm 
gonna add a little bit more chicken broth. Well, the rest of it that was in here. And about a cup of half and half. Let me get that stirred up. Get this stirred up. Yes, them grits is looking real good. Oh yeah. We don't want them grits to get too thick. Yes. Okay, let me put the top back on. And let them go for about maybe two or three more minutes. Get that half and half stirred up in there. And listen, we're gonna put some bacon in there too. About four, four sticks of bacon. And uh, I have chopped it up really good. And those little pink shrimp, the little bitty tiny ones that are already cooked. We're gonna put those in there, about a cup. And spinach, now I use canned spinach, but you can use the, uh, let me turn down a bit. You can use the um, frozen spinach, or even you can use the um, the fresh spinach. Okay. Yes. Now, and I'm gonna let this simmer for about maybe about five minutes. About five minutes. I'm gonna let it simmer. See that? Don't that look so good? Mm-mm. We gonna let it simmer for about five minutes, okay? Along with them grits. Them grits just about done. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. Here's the sauce. Wee! It looking good. And I'm going to add, I'm going to turn the eye down just a hair. Then I'm going to turn the eye up on the fish uh, oil. And I'm going to add like a half a teaspoon of lemon juice. Okay. Yes. Now I'm fixing to fry my fish. My grits are done back on the bag. Let me let you look at them. Mm. Okay. There those grits are. Can you see them? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes. And they're a little dark. Cause like I say, danger average grits for breakfast in the morning. These have got Cajun bouillon cube in them. Okay, let me put the top back on. Let me check my grits for frying. Mash it around in the fish, uh, mash the um, fish flour or whatever you call it around in the fish stuff. Okay. 
Alright, now, there it goes. I want that fish to have a lot of batter on it. So I'm gonna mash it around in there real good. Let me turn it up. And I got one more piece to put in here. Put you down there where you can see. All in them crevices. Okay. Now, waiting on that piece to fry. I'm going to turn this sauce off in the back. I don't want that to burn. Little spinach, bacon, shrimp, sauce. Ooh wee! Okay, let me turn it off. I'm gonna let this fish fry, and I'll be right back with you. Y'all, look at that fish frying around in that uh, grease. When I come back, I'll be big, put, putting me a plate up. Yes, I will be putting me a plate fish, grits, and uh, finish some. Oh, okay. Okay, guys. Here is my fried fish grits with bacon, shrimp, and spinach sauce. This is going to be a really, really good one. Look, I put everything in the seafood bowl in here. Yes. Yeah. And I hope it's cool enough for my mouth. Mm. I hadn't bit into the fish yet. The fish is so hot. Good flaky fish. Mm-hmm. Look, that a little bit of shrimp. A tiny little shrimp. Mm-hmm. Yes. Oh, I dipped in the bottom, got me some grits. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Get a grits. Mm. This is so hot. Spicy and good. Mmm. Mmm. I'm gonna get a little shrimp there with that spinach sauce. See? Mmm. And you can use fresh uh, spinach. Spinach out your can. Ooh, it's hot. Spinach out your can. Or uh, what other kind of spinach you want to use? And you don't have to put that bouillon cube in there, that uh, Cajun bouillon cube in your grits. You can just make regular grits if you want to. Mm-hmm. But this is one delicious meal. Mm. 
Mmm. 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 Too hot for me to lift up. Fried fish, grits, with bacon, shrimp, and spinach sauce. Subscribe to this uh, video. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, it's so spicy and good. I know I'm going to have to fix this for my kids tomorrow. Because they're going to look at this video and say, Mom. Mm-hmm. 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 Y'all stay humble. Be blessed. Have a good day. The Lord have mercy. Y'all ain't got to go home. But you gotta get up out of here.